Let's roll. We got ourselves a Magician versus Fox matchup. So, in our last game, we saw Alice versus Macalon. That was very, very scrappy, very up close and personal. We have Magician, who is very much a setup and trap character. Very powerful in the hands of the right player. And of course, Fox with a a touch of death character. If Fox touches you once, you could die off like three hits. So we'll see what happens here. Pekin Mario is sending out the statue. Gets a quick 10%. Hits the card into a few up airs. Get a nice 39%. Huge parries coming out. Up tilt. Uh, sending out more of the cards. I will say I'm not as versed in these two characters, but I do know enough to commentate a bit has a dash attack into a statue into a forward smash almost gets the kill but jjc with a solid 92 chunk of 92 damage on him do the marios in firm control of this game one goes with the forward smash both characters just kind of swinging i guess this is a little bit of a scrappier one but jjc hitting these fox conversions able to get a nice 40 percent pk the mario pk the mario do the mario hitting an upbeat over the ledge to catch jjc a little bit off guard Ooh, went for a another upbeat kill, a good kill confirm, kill option for Mario, but when it does not land, uh, you can get hard punished, but JJC not able to get too much of a punish, but enough to even out this game. Both characters at kill percent do the Mario with the upbeat side upbeat to upbeat to the ledge, but also not. He got the kill. He got the kill. That's <laughs> he got the kill, and that's what matters. Mario popping off a Magician. Statue, once again, going over the side. The statue is such a... It's not only a strong projectile, it's also just the option of it and the threat of it being there is so powerful. It can really catch you off guard. Mario with some nice forward air conversions here. But JJC, of course, Fox with the one of the best recoveries in the game. It can also go into center stage if you aren't ready to catch it. Fox can pretty much recover any time, anywhere. But, thing Fox, that's not going to help you from uh, avoiding those statues as do the Mario almost lapping JJC in percent on JJC's second stock. Do the Mario on his first still unable to clean it up. Two, three stocks to one. Do the Mario with a firm advantage. Ooh, the down tilt crouch a little bit of a, a little bit of, for some people it's disrespectful. For others it's a spacing tool. Uh, make up your mind on what you think it is, but hey. Sivy to ledge, ooh, definitely looking to snap to ledge, but unfortunately landing on stage, JJC able to clean up, do the Mario's first stock, but still a long road to go if he wants to get this game under his belt. The card comes out, it's such a strong projectile from a magician. The statue's good, but that card, it also sends wherever the heck he wanted to send, really. Dash attack coming out. JJC trying to hit, get the get up attack, but it hits the statue and not strong enough to hit it. Four throw into the hit statue and the Mar do the Mario with a fantastic conversion to close out game one with a dominant two stock. The game count going up one, two, zero. And do the Mario's favor. Of course, that being said, even though JJC was on the back foot for most of that game, Fox, once again, is a touch of death character. So at any moment, JJC can even this up. Even if you run it back. So we'll see what happens here. Will they stick? Will they not? So thanks everyone for the follows. I hope that I can bring Flashpoint to you weekly. Oh, okay. Probably getting more pings. We get into game two here. I'm gonna deal something quickly. All right, so we have once again running it back, same stage, same everything. Ooh, JJC hits the get up attack, but gets clipped by the statue. But gets the grabs, gets the up airs in up air drag downs into grab combos. And like I said, touch of death, not able to get the full conversion off stage to get a kill, but a solid amount of percent racked up on P do the Mario. Able to hit that up B to get rid of any potential options. Uh, sends out the statue, hits it out, 
due to Mario getting so much off of these statues, tries to go for a grounded up B hitbox to potentially get the kill. Does not work out. JJC able to get the punish. And now both players pretty much even percent. JJC with the get up attack, sending Dude the Mario so far out. Dude the Mario, of course. It was early recoveries to get back to stage, catching JJC a little bit off guard and able to clean up that first stock. Statue coming out once again to the Mario charging up an errant forward smash. The balls in this man. JJC, of course, not going to fall for it and regain neutral. Dash attacks coming out from Do the Mario. Two hit dash attacks really do sometimes catch people off guard. Or maybe it just catches me off guard, because as we all know, there's a reason why I'm commentating and not actually playing in this tournament. <laughs> JGC doesn't know to play anything but Fox. Hey, that's fine, you know? There are people who have counter picks for matchups, and there are people who take the time to master one character and win all their losing matchups. And then there's me, who plays every character and is just bad at every character. Uh, dash attack from Do the Mario coming out, and it's looking like he's gonna try to take it to another 3-1. JJC hanging out on ledge just a little bit too much, and Do the Mario once again up three stocks to one. JJC hitting clipped by the hat, but able to hit it, so the statue does not come out. Goes for a grab, but Do the Mario well into the air, not gonna get caught by that. No tech, but able to get the roll in. Now both players just kind of spacing out. Do the Mario is kind of walling out any of JJC's offense, taking it slow. Making JJC come to him, and when and when they do, do the Mario able to punish with every single move in this man's arsenal. Magician's arsenal. Quite literally a toolkit full of endless possibilities. And JJC not able to find the right tool for the job, as do the Mario looking to clean this up, this time with a 3 stock. No! JJC with a huge back throw, Sparta kicking, do the Mario out into the blast zone, but a 97% deficit. Sorry, a one stock and now 113% deficit. And into the forward smash, Drew the Mario up 2-0 on JJC.